Hello everyone and welcome back to Fair the Outdoors. Today uh, I'm going to do a bit of an unboxing. I went out and bought, ordered some uh, a tent and a sleeping mat and a sleeping bag on Amazon and I'm just going to open it up, see what we think. I went kind of on the cheaper side just to kind of see what we can get for a, a low budget camping set setup. So uh, start with this package, I'm not even sure what's in this one. So this one here is the tent. So this one right here is a fly top tent. It's a one person tent and uh, we'll set that up in a second. Comes with tent pegs and posts, packs up nice and small. This stuff here is all for uh, Backwoods camping, so pack in or canoe in camping. Let's see what we get out here. Pegs, posts, here's the canvas. Looks like a good material. We'll set that up in a second and see what see what it's actually like. This one here is the self-inflating air mattress. Trip Hunter. This here is the Tetan, Tetan Sport. Now this one I got because my brother and my dad have one and I know it's good quality. Sometimes we do some pretty cold camping and wanted to make sure I stayed warm. So this one I kind of know. It's a good quality. It's uh, the mummy style, which some people like it, some people don't. I've learned to live with it, so. All right, let's get to setting up this tent and see what it's like. All right, so we're gonna set up this tent right here. Um, they don't really come with instructions, so I guess we'll see how it works out. All right, so we got it this far. Um, the one thing I did like about this tent, and I've seen it in the reviews, is it's got a door on both sides. So it's got a door here, and it's got a door over here. So you can you can go enter and exit either way. Um, the one thing I one of the things I didn't like was this mesh here. I wasn't very happy with how how high it goes or how high it is. I would I prefer it down here more, just because when you're out in the elements, it's nice to. If you have nice weather, you can look outside, see the stars, see the surroundings. But that's minor, neither here nor there. Um, one thing I'm do noticing now, as I look at it, that's kind of concerning is this this material that the rods go through. It is like a mesh, so I'm kind of concerned as to how long that will last before it starts ripping. Um, the one thing that is good about the rods is they don't have it's it's a seamless seamless rod. There's no uh, connect connections that stick out like most tents have, so it rides nice and smoothly through there. Alright, then we'll put on the canvas yet and we'll see what that looks like. All right, so there's the canvas on top. Works out pretty good. The pegs seem sturdy, they're all aluminum, so they're super light, but uh, hopefully they don't bend. All right, it's kind of dark, but I got lots of room on top and bottom. Got a little bit of extra room here for storing stuff. Um, one thing I am noticing though is 
this canvas does not stick out very far here. So, uh, not a whole lot of room right there, but it should keep uh, keep you dry and it might be able to store some stuff there overnight. But that's it for now. Thanks for watching and uh, see you later.